I'm going to start by explaining the word classes. First, a pronoun. This is a word that replaces a noun so that we don't have to keep repeating it. The word it is a pronoun. Then an adjective is, of course, a describing word. A verb is a doing word. An adverb tells us how something is done and usually ends in ly. A noun is a word for a thing. A conjunction is a joining word. It joins two words or two parts of a sentence. And is the commonest one. A determiner determines what kind of word comes next. For example, in the phrase these pens, these is a determiner. Finally, a preposition positions a word in relation to another one. If I say I'm making this video for you, for is a preposition. OK, now let's look at the list of words that we have to identify. First, we've got kingdom. A kingdom is a thing. It's an abstract thing, but nonetheless a thing. So what does that make it? That's right, it's a noun. Next, dominant. The phrase is a dominant colour. Colour is a noun, so dominant describes it. In that case, it's an adjective. Then you have C, the little word the. The seeds. This is a determiner. It determines what kind of word is going to follow. It doesn't tell us very much about the word that's going to follow, but it's a determiner. Next we have or. Between the words intentionally and accidentally. It tells us that there are options. So what is it? It's a conjunction. It joins these two words. Next, accidentally. The fact that it ends in ly gives you a clue. OK, it tells you one of the ways in which the seeds might be brought with them. That makes it an adverb. Next, brought is the past tense of bring. Bring is a doing word. So what does that make it? That's right, it's a verb. Next, we have with. It's a small word that makes a connection between them, the pronoun them, which stands for the Martians, and the seeds earlier on in the sentence. It positions them in relation to each other, which makes it a preposition. Finally, we have them, which, as I said, is a pronoun that stands in place of Martians. So it's instead of a noun. So it's a pronoun. 